Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Uh, Chicago Patriot Prepper here. Uh, I ask that you please like, subscribe, like, subscribe, and hit the thumbs up for my channel and hit notifications. Uh, you know, I was thinking, and I'm doing this, uh, you know, this video, and uh, weren't things really easier when we just had cash? Uh, well, you know, or just a, a regular simple credit card? So everything is tied together. I mean, think of look at look at the problems that uh, technology has uh, caused us. You know, when you go, when you make a phone call, how long does it take you to reach someone on the phone? Please hit this. Please hit that. Sometimes they don't ever call you back. Before there was always a person there for you to call. Uh, and you know, you always got you always got your stuff. I mean, like I've been having a problem getting my prescription for a month now uh, because I changed insurances and. Uh, no one knows what's going on here, and you got to do this and go back. But uh, uh, I have a big girl. That's my dog, CJ. She's not even coughing. She just she one of the guys moved. So, uh, so the, I'm just bringing you. There has been a made a massive, massive data breach, and it's been going on for about uh, two or three re weeks right now. And uh, some governments are telling people to actually freeze their. Uh, their credit accounts until they uh, you could actually see what's going on. I believe they've been actually trying to plug up the holes in all this mess. Uh, even the Department of Motor Vehicles have been hacked, and uh, and you know their system and they've just been stealing information. They're not shutting anything down. They're not. They didn't hold it for ransom uh, traditionally to shut it down. But uh, I'll get to the rest in a second. Uh, they're also stealing information, personal data, and uh, the data is from a, uh, uh, a program sharing company. I believe it's called Move It. That's what it's all uh, associated with. And uh, a couple of states that have been hit is Oregon and Louisiana. The governments uh, name Social Security and uh, linking them to their where their addresses are is, uh, have also been stolen and. Uh, I don't know how many people Oregon have. It was it about four, four and a half million or something like that. I'm not sure, but uh, the uh, Secretary of State or whoever controls the DMV or their identities and all their s s state IDs, saying that three and a half million people have been impacted and that their identities have been compromised. Okay, Maryland officials are also telling people to freeze their credit and check for fraud. Uh, fraudulent charges on their credit cards. Uh, the uh, the bank, I believe it's called Columbia, Columbia Bank, they merged with the, uh, another bank. They're mostly on the West Coast, and I believe they had between uh, like uh, three and four hundred uh, branches. Uh, they were actually uh, had two, uh, but they're mostly on the West Coast, and uh, a uh, and there is actually someone taking uh, credit for this. A cyber attack group called uh, Out of Russia named Klopp is threatening to release people's data unless they get paid. Because that, that's the one bad thing. Uh, sure, we're going to pay you not to release it, but then they still have the information. They could go back and they could say, oh, well, you won't pay us again. We're going to release it. So, uh, uh that's one thing I guess you just don't get, you don't give into. I mean, it's just really, really screwed up. The reason saying that the uh, uh, that the, a lot of federal governments, uh, the agency has been hacked, uh, but this actually be, the they're, they're uh, for, for the federal government. There may be a silver lining to this. This is. Uh, there was a member, was it Rahm Emanuel or whoever else says that never let a good, uh, never let a crisis go to waste. This may be the federal government's way of uh, putting you on a digital ID and keeping track of everything that you earn, that you spend. That way, uh, that money cannot be stolen if there's like a, it's like a serial number. Everything has a serial number where it goes and it can be tracked. So they can actually track, uh, how much money you make, uh, where you spend it on. If, if everything's digital, like your health records that they've also been stolen, they can actually deny you, uh, say, oh, this guy's cholesterol is high. 
Uh, so he cannot buy red meat or he can't buy a burger from somewhere. Or uh, if he's an alcoholic, he cannot uh, go buy beer somewhere with this with this uh, with this ID. So that's uh, it'll, I don't know if it would be linked to your phone or not. I know one of the governments in Africa did it or tried it, and it turned out to be a total disaster. So uh, uh, maybe everyone should just go be going back to cash and going back to uh, silverbacks and goldbacks and. Uh, uh, from what I understand, things got really bad after the 70s with, as far as financial problems with the entire country. So, again, this is Chicago Patriot Prepper out. I ask that you please like and subscribe and hit notification to this video. Uh, I will be releasing some, uh, some uh, fun videos with our president.